Hello friends, welcome to IntelliGear and this review of the Commando Wire Saw. So I've had uh, some of these riding in my survival kit and I figured while I was uh, testing out some other saws I might as well break this thing out and I never bought this intending it to be my primary saw. It was just more um, something that was lightweight that um, I've seen some other reviews on and if, if you had to in a pinch you could um, you could use this to cut through some wood so I figured I would go ahead and do that and um, you'll see here in this video that um, it looks pretty promising and I'm cutting through the wood it looks like everything's going good and then it uh, it binds up so you know I have to take it completely out and uh, try again and I'm just gonna tell you that unless you're cutting through some small branches and you know this branch I'm cutting through it could be the size of some small trees or something but you know if this is the only thing you have good luck trying to build a lean-to or something if this is the only uh, saw that you have on you it it's gonna require in my opinion way more calories than if you would have just packed a little bit extra weight and brought like a folding saw or something with you now that being said I'm not gonna do away with these and I'm not giving it a fail review even though it was difficult it obviously could be done um, one of the things that that I realized is the angle of your your uh, approach when you're cutting on this the natural tendency is to have the saw in more of a U configuration as you're going around the branch um, but that's when the binding seems to occur and it seems like the only way I could keep sawing through uh, this particular branch was to try to keep the um, the saw wire as flat as as possible uh, more like would be on a traditional saw so that would require a lot more calories as well and it's a a lot less ergonomic and natural to do uh, to do it that way now th that being said um, I'm still gonna have this in my in my uh, emergency kit my survival kit because it is lightweight and um, you know you go on a day hike or something you can you can coil this up and you won't even realize it's there it weighs next to nothing and if you did need to cut through some small branches or something you could still do it and then the other thing is um, this particular one I believe this was a, a Coglins brand but as you can see this passes through uh, one ring is bigger than the other and they say that you can use this as a snare so um, I'm gonna hang on to it for that reason as well now I've never used this I've never snared anything I'm not a I'm not a trapper I'm not a hunter so uh, I couldn't tell you if that works or if it would work just as good as better as a traditional snare I really don't know but for the weight I'll keep that in my uh, my day hiker um, survival kit when I go out there in the woods uh, so there you go that's my take on the wire commando saw and if you like uh, these videos, please hit that like button or, or subscribe. I'll have more videos coming soon. Thanks a lot, friends. Be well.